Jacob plans to assassinate the Earl of Cardigan within the Houses of Parliament.
What's this nonsense about needing a password to see Lord Cardigan today? Relax. I've got it in my pocket. Look sharp, men. Allow no one past unless I authorize them. Cardigan has gone too far this time. I've a mind to contact Scotland Yard myself. Come now, gentlemen. I thought us united in opposition against this perfidious law. Assassinate Lord Cardigan, explore the area, identify opportunities, minister, unique kill opportunity, corrupt police van, stealth opportunity, politician assistance opportunity. Okay, this is gonna be fun. Policeman, easy entry into Parliament. Guards will move out of his way. Kidnap the policeman. Locate the target. Follow him to Lord Cardigan's office. I want to see who wins this fight. Lord Cardigan's password. Okay.
chair. Oh, what the heck? Apologize for any background noise you guys might be hearing. Gentlemen, Sergeant Freddie Aberline of Scotland Yard. Where might this scandalous activity be taking place? Oh, yes, yes, yes. Uh, just this way. Follow me, Sergeant, but discreetly, if you would. One doesn't like to be seen airing a fellow member of Parliament's dirty linen. What? <laughs> I'll be very discreet. Usually I would be in disguise, but my clothes all fell into the Thames. That's a lie. it up god dang it I think I messed it up I messed the politician thing up. So now I have to go kidnap the policeman. Hopefully it doesn't like reset the mission. I know what I need to do.
stone dead. Oh god. Someone's kicked the bucket. You don't see the other body. I just need to get inside. No need for this to get messy. Let's see what's happening. Make a sound and it'll be your last. <laughs> I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I recommend you stop struggling. Okay, just hold it. There we go. Now, can I talk to the politician? No. Oh. Wait. Am I supposed to be following him? Please tell me I can get it. Yes, okay. Oh Jesus, no. Okay, we're good. Wow. this like je good god who the bloody hell oh shut up <laughs> coward 
villain! Alas, that the hero of Balaclava should fall not on the glory fields of Crimea, but to an assassin's blade in the very halls of power. And you finished yet? Take your bow, knave, for you have managed what no Russian battery, what no Indian tiger could achieve. Claim your trophy, and may you choke on it. Yes, but do tell me more about Balaclava. Farewell. Farewell, dear Britannia. Your dawn shall be dimmer that the Earl of Cardigan sees it not. God save the Queen and the Eleventh Hussars. What a prick. Let's go this way. That's not where I wanted to go. <sighs> nice. Good stuff. Apart from the death squad on our tail, apart from that. Backup's on the way. Why are you pushing yourself so hard? It's not your job to fight Templars. I had this colleague. He was our boss's son. I didn't much care for him at the start. Everyone treated him like he was so bloody special. To me, he just wasn't invested in, in, in anything that didn't affect him personally. But I was wrong about him. He became my friend. Put himself through hell, and he saved us all in the end. So I reckon. Well, I can't apologize to him, but I can. I don't know. I can try and live up to his example. You are a good assassin. Holy jeez! Hello. It has been too long. Galena. I mean, I have not seen you since we blew up that lab in Paris. Uh, there were many explosions, and you screamed like a baby. Bishop tells me Old Soberg is here. I will kill him for you. Super, great news. Now, if you wouldn't mind keeping watch, I am going to lie down and die now. Rest. We have a big fight coming. Sean and Rebecca are safe for now, but we're still relying on you to find us that shroud. <laughs> 